little bit about uh, how I confused grackles. Why well, I confused brown thrashers with grackles. Female grackle. That's a funny word. Grackle! Uh, well, grackle's a type of bird. I'll put a couple pictures. But the male is, a, is black. The female is brown. So... They look like, it looks like a crow. The black ones look like crows and the brown ones look like, I thought were brown thrashers, but the beak was is longer when I really looked into it. And uh, so I wanted to see what the symbolism of a grackle was. Looks like I only took one, but they, I only got one source, but they use a couple of my favorite sources like Miller's Guild and um, what else they use? ubcbirds.com so from atshq.org grackle symbolism and meaning the grackle is a small beautiful black bird native to north america it is a small bird that compared to other black birds is seen as taller and has a longer tail it has a narrow beak and yellow eyes though its most distinguishable trait is its iridescent feathers the grackle, like other blackbirds, represents numerous good signs and traits, though this may surprise some who believe that such birds are instead a sign of bad things to come. The idea that blackbirds represent darkness comes from the dark black color of the bird's wings. According to Miller's Guild, black is seen as the color of mystery and mysticism, so that these birds may bring feelings of unfamiliarity, caution, and even restraint. Whoa, that sounds racist. That said, grackles are beautiful, gleaming birds that, as their feathers may suggest, like to express themselves in numerous ways. One such method may include how male grackles try to catch the attention of potential partners during mating season. During the early spring, the male grackle will preen itself by straightening and cleaning its feathers to appeal to a female. It will also make itself appear larger by fluffing its feathers while squeaking and strutting around a potential mate. It's how we stand up a little straighter, feel a little swollen. It's due to these demonstrative behaviors that the grackle is an excellent symbol of self-expression and even flirtation. The grackle also partakes in an activity called anting, which involves allowing ants to climb on its body so that they may cover the grackle's body in secretions. They do this to eliminate parasites and maintain their cleanliness another trait that the bird is known for. With its focus on appearance, it is clear that the grackle is a social bird that tends to travel in large flocks. As mentioned by abcbirds.org and American Bird Conservancy. It is no surprise that the grackle is also a symbol of communication and family. The grackle is sociable, whose overtly expressive nature should demonstrate the importance of expressing your feelings and actively communicating with those around you. The grackle's dedication to its family makes it a courageous bird, as it will do anything to protect its family, including dive bombing a potential threat. Coincidentally, it will also take the same aggressive approach when foraging and stealing food from other animals and humans. Due to these two traits, the grackle is also a symbol of bravery and thievery. Lastly, like most other blackbirds, the grackle is well known for its intelligence. Similar to crows and ravens, the grackle can solve puzzles and even use problem-solving skills to open particularly tough nuts. One way it does so is by soaking its food in water to soften it. Very nice. So, the grackle symbolism. Um... I'm trying to rap like do like a little summary. All right, so it's a it's a, it's a symbol of self-expression, flirtation, cleanliness, like maintain cleanliness. Um, so it's like if you want to, you know, kind of step your game up, you know, be clean, bathe yourself, look good, wear some nice clothes, you know, if you're gonna go talk to the opposite sex. Or anywhere you go. Um, and it's social. So it's a sign of communication and family, which is always important. Even though, you know, 
know sometimes it can feel toxic it still is, it's like a necessity for some reason uh no i mean it's just we're supposed it's just because in the long run you'll need each other that's the selfish way of looking at it um so yeah in, in uh, con communicating well is another symbol of of seeing the grack like communicate yourself well also to be brave and maybe still shit not just kidding but to be brave and intelligent all right so let me check the camera i'm gonna do a dream meaning